Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be just a random collective haul. I feel like I haven't sat down and did a haul in forever. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys some of the pieces that I've been picking up. I have a few clothing items. I have more clothing items on the way, but that'll be in another video. I have more beauty items. And I also have a um, DIY situation that I'm doing. So I'm going to show you some of those items as well. Um, if I can fit it into this video because I don't want this video to be so long. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. And before I do, yes, I did change my hair. Today is the 17th, so December 17th. And I took my hair down day before yesterday. I took the sewing out and I washed and deconditioned it. I just had to. My hair was getting kind of itchy and dry. And I had a lot of new growth. I mean a lot. So I went ahead and I took that out. I did order more hair where well, I do have it, but I'm going to do a video probably after the holidays. Um, and I'm going to keep this in. This is the same hair that I had in before the other hair. So it's pretty good. It's still the same U part and it's amazing. Still soft and manageable and everything. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, I'm going to start off with this pair of shoes first because it's the only pair that I have. Um, that I want to show. I did just order some more um, booties because I feel like I don't have any, but I do, but that's just me. So I got these um, from Just Fab because I forgot to skip the month. Um, normally I skip the month and then I go on and if I see something I'll purchase it, but I haven't been seeing anything lately that I wanted, but since I had a credit, I just went ahead and picked something out. And these are the Perina heels in, in the color black. So I was not um, too happy with these. I will say that. Um, but I do like them overall. But I, I'm just not happy about the quality of these shoes. So I'm becoming a, a quality whore. And these shoes just was, wasn't up to par with quality for me. But uh, nevertheless, I probably get about two, three uses out of them and then be done with them. And this is how they look. They're really, really cute, don't get me wrong, but I'm just not too happy with the quality. So this is how they look, and this is supposed to wrap around your ankle like that. And then you have this little nice crisscross design in the front that goes... I'm trying to show you guys the shoe before okay it goes like that if you can see that so that goes like that and then the scraps right here goes across your ankle so it's a really really cute shoe i like the style of it i just wish that the quality was a lot better the material i'm not sure what material this is but it is kind of soft um i like that i wish that it was like a better quality i wish that it was like a suede I'm not sure what material this is. It doesn't say. Um, I don't know, but it's really cute. I got them in a size 9. So I might end up wearing them this Friday. I have a holiday party that I have to go to. So, yeah, I might just go ahead and get a use out of them. And, you know, they cute on, but, yeah, I'm just not pleased with the quality. But these are it. Okay, so that's it for the shoe. I have... A few pieces that I picked up from Forever 21, and I just, as you guys, if you guys know, and you've been watching my videos, you know that I am doing like a whole lifestyle change, everything from closet re revamping my closet to everything. So I recently did my closet um, the way I wanted it. I still have about two furniture pieces that I have to get from my closet. And it'll be complete but everything as far as clothes that I don't want and handbags and purses and accessories, all of that has been gone. It's been donated to my, some of my mom friends and as well as my sister so done with it. And um, along the way of doing my wardrobe over, you, I realized that I did not have many of my basic items. Because I've been throwing them away, I get so annoyed with how, you know, like basic tanks and stuff look after like a few um, uses and washes. So I, I just have like, I don't know, what, 
symptoms I have, but I just throw them out. I just get them, get rid of them. So I went um, on Forever 21 and I stacked up on a whole bunch of the tanks or the camis. And I got some of every color. I did just order another order online with some camis and some other items that I was interested in because when I ordered these, they didn't have all the colors that I wanted. So I got white, I got ivory, I got this really nice um, tan color, peachy, it's like a peachy tan color. I got this nice mauve color, I have a red, I have this nice um, eggplant color, nice um, olive color, a light gray, a dark gray, and then I'm wearing the black one right now. So. I ordered the other colors that they didn't have in stock, like the navy, and um, it was some more other colors, as well as I ordered two more blacks and two more whites, because you can never go wrong with those two staple colors. So these were only $1.90, and I got them in a size extra large, and I'm so short that these go all the way down to my butt, like this. It's crazy how short I am, but yeah. So that was a dollar ninety. I got them in extra large, and I absolutely needed these. These are good to wear under um, tops, to wear with just like this, like a blazer or a cardigan. So I definitely have to stock up on those. Now I'm looking for long sleeve tops that I think is nice quality. I don't want the ones from Fair Twenty One, um, but I want some really nice quality long sleeve tops and some turtlenecks but those will do for now also from forever 21 I got a few other pieces and I'm going to start off with these two pieces first this one I got a while ago on an online order and I just was holding it to show you guys until I got more items to show you and this is like a really nice um sweater material Kind of like a crop top. It's not that crop, but it's not long. And this is this was fifteen eighty, and I got it in a size large. I was planning on taking this to the Bahamas with me, but I didn't because I felt like it was too thick. So I might end up keep wearing it this winter, and you know, as a pop of color, or just keeping it for the spring. So I got that. And then I also got this top right here. I did wear the other top. I got this with the buy one get one free sale. And this is the um top that I got. It's a high low knit top as they say. It's black and the color is messing up because of the top, but excuse it. And it has like these little um studs on it. It's like a faux leather in the front and then it's a really nice thick material in the back with the exposed silver zipper and it's just in a size large and if it, it is quite a little bit big but I want it loose I don't want it to be fitted because I can wear this with some blue jeans and a blazer and some nice heels of pumps and it'll be really really cute so I got that and the shirt that I got for free it was like a muscle shirt and I already wore that so it's in a dirty clothes actually so I can't show you guys that but I already wore it and then I ended up getting this a while ago um, around the same time I got those items because this is not even available on the site anymore um, but it's a, there were separate, but it, it could be worn as a two piece. And I'm actually going to wear it separate because I feel like this together is too much for it to be worn together. Like I do have some, um, coordinates that I will wear together, but this is just too much. So this is the skirt and I actually love the fit of this skirt. It feels like, it fits like a really nice, um, pencil bodycon skirt. And I got this in an extra large and it was $14.80. And it has a really nice detail to it. That's what caught my attention and I love gold. So it's a black background with gold detailing. And I feel like this would be great for a holiday party paired with some really nice heels. And you could even wear it with a black top or crop top or a blazer or a cami. And just do whatever you want to do with it. You can even wear it with a white top and then have a black blazer and some heels and have a red lip. It'll be cute. So this is the crop top 
And I got this in a size extra large as well, and it was $11.80. And I plan on wearing this with a skirt, a black skirt. And this, this crop top fits amazing. I absolutely love the way it just hugs every part of the top part. So I really like this one. And um, I'm not too fond with the quality, but I could get a good two to three uses out of it. And, um, you know, have a little nice pictures and outfits. So that's it with Forever 21. Then from ASOS or ASOS, I really don't know how you supposed to say it. I got one item because I actually haven't um, purchased any clothing items from ASOS. I do love their accessories and their purses, but I haven't purchased any clothing items. So I just wanted to try one clothing item to see how the sizes run and how the quality is. So I got this really nice, really, really nice faux leather skirt. And it's it's this skirt is extremely heavy. You would think that's it's that is real genuine leather, but it's faux leather. And I love the way it fits. This is the back. It has the um zipper in the back. Really, really nice. I plan on wearing this actually to the holiday party on Friday. So hopefully I can get a picture up on Instagram or shoot the outfit of the night video or something like that. But it is from ASOS and I ordered this online about, I don't know, about two, three months ago. And it was originally like 60 bucks for this um, skirt, but I ended up catching it on sale for like $20 and some change. And I was so happy. So I got this in a size US 12 and it fits amazing. It is a little bit loose, but I'd rather it be loose than tight and too big. So I absolutely love it. So I could, um, yeah, I love it. I just love it. So I'm going to wear this on Friday and I just love that skirt. I tried it on and I fell in love. So now I have two pieces from She Inside. Now, Everybody been talking about she inside and I decided to just go in, jump on a bandwagon and purchase some items from she inside. I actually have a skirt, one of those little flowy chiffon type skirts that everybody been wearing because I wanted to wear it on Christmas, but it's so annoying because they even they haven't even shipped it yet and then on top of that I'm gonna have to wait about a week or two to get the item. So I know it's not gonna be here in time for Christmas. So now I'm gonna have to figure out what I want to wear for Christmas, I probably end up wearing a black and gold skirt and some heels and probably a white top or something with it and just be done with it. But anywho, I got these two tops. One of them you have already seen already. I posted the pictures on Instagram when I was in school. I wore this about two times already. It's a really nice um, sweater. And the bottom of it, it's a really long sweater. And the bottom of it has this detailing with the faux zippers it's not um no pockets or anything it's like faux zippers and it has the little sides out it's it fits amazing and i had got so many compliments when i wore it so i wore it to work one day and i also wore it to school when i posted the instagram picture and it's a really nice quality have the exposed zipper on the back and i believe this was like no more than 15 bucks I believe um, so it was really really nice I think this was like $13 or something like that and I do believe they still have it um, if they do I'll leave the link down below so I got that one and I worn it about two or three times and I just got this one in the mail day before yesterday I haven't worn it yet I just took it out the plastic and slapped it on the hanger so this one here is a really nice it's it was supposed to it was on the website as a jacket, but I know it's not a jacket. It's like a, um, it's kind of like a cape style cardigan. That's, that's what I'm going to put it. And the detailing, this is the front. It's like crisscross where it has that cape like feel to it. And then it has the sweater bat wing arms. And it also has the effect of a turtleneck. So I absolutely like this one. And the back of it is this really nice sweater material. And it is really, really long, so it will cover your butt if you want to wear like some leggings and a little cami underneath. It will cover your butt, so I really, really like it. 
And this was, I believe, this was, um, I believe this was like $15. So, really, really inexpensive. So, I got that. And hopefully when I get my skirt, I'll love it. It is some more items on there that I want to purchase. But I'm going to hold off until I get my skirt and see if I like my skirt. Now I'm going to go on into the makeup items. I don't have many makeup items because as you know, I've cleaned out my makeup. And I've only been focusing on high-end products. I did ask for some for Christmas. So I know I'm going to get some for Christmas. But these are the items that I purchased myself recently. And for one, I'm going to start with the items that I got from, uh, was it Sephora? No, it was from Ulta. This is the only thing that I got from Ulta. And this is the Lorac, the Royal Lip Luster Cream Collection. And I know I had to get these because I love the holiday editions that I got gifted the prior year or two years ago. And these have no glitters in it and they're really nice and creamy. So this was $25, and I know a lot of people probably already showed, but the videos I've seen, they actually haven't took it out the package and did, um, and showed them. So these are the colors. Really nice array of colors. You have new, you have array, you have a few pinks, and you also have like a mauve um, type purple color here. So some really, really nice. Lip, um, lip glosses and I'm going to swatch one of them so you can see the thickness of it and I don't know why but I'm a drawn to red so I'm going to swatch this one and this one is called Crown Jewel the red one and it smells so good it smells like candy and they have like the little brush applicator And these are really, really, really creamy and really, really opaque. So that's the red one right there. Really, really nice. I absolutely love Lorac lip glosses. And then with that, I got a sample of a Lorac lip luster gloss. And this is like the one with the glitter, the glitter in it. And it came in this little box right here. I thought it was so cute. So it's this one here. They do have more shades and full sizes, but this is just a sample. And I had this one in my um, makeup bag in my purse. And this little lip gloss like this. And this one is in the shade Peach Luster. And this one has shimmer in it. And that's Peach Luster right there. So, yeah. So, that's it from Ulta. Then I have some MAC lipsticks here. I picked up three recently that I've been wearing, so I don't have them in a box. I threw the boxes away. I have Smoke Purple, Living Legend, and Fashion Revival. I have been wearing them, and I posted a few pictures on Instagram. So if you want to see them on me, go on my Instagram. This one is Smoke Purple, and it's just a really smoky purple. I absolutely love this lipstick. I got tons of compliments when I wore it to work, and I just dropped it, but whatever. I have Fashion Revival, which is a really nice, like a raspberry-ish shade. And that's that color right there absolutely love it and then we have living legend and all of these are a matte finish by the way and this is living legend and i'm going to put this one right here and it's a really dark like black cherry type color and that's it right there and it's gorgeous now for the last two we have these that i just recently purchased and got from I don't even know the name of the collection, but this one is, these two are Ronner and Gunner, and I didn't want Stoner because it's just like, it looks like a, a basic red to me, so I didn't want it. And this one is Ronner, and it's a really nice, like, burgundy shade, and this is a matte finish as well. Yeah, this is like a burgundy wine shade. It's more like wine, actually. And that's the color right there. Okay. And then we have Goner, which is a really nice purple. 
And this is matte as well. And this purple is like so like a gothic purple. And that's it right there. It looks like a blue on the camera. It's actually showing up blue on the camera. But it is purple, guys. I'm telling you. And it's gorgeous. Oh, it's just gorgeous. So that's that. So that's it with all the makeup. You guys know that um I'm on like a no beauty drugstore makeup buy, so everything is has to be high quality, high end because I'm just tired of wasting my money on drugstore makeup and not being happy with it. So that's it for the beauty products. I only have these um, little DIY items that I have. I want to show you really quickly because it's not, it's only one item actually. So um, I'm doing my whole bedroom over. Um, so now I'm going to be doing some upgrades on my furniture and I got these um, knobs for my dressers. So I got these from Marshalls and they were $5.99 each. So I got um, the flower looky details for my dresser and then I have these here, the regular jewel for the boo dresser. So yeah, so it's kind of like a his and hers type of situation. I didn't want the models to be girly and then, you know, he say something about it. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I got a few of each of those. Um, and I'm on a hunt for some more because I have my TV stand that I want to redo over now. But yeah, that's a whole nother story. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this little random haul. Let me know what you guys have been buying. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.